Hello, so it's E back again. Um, Eclipse, either way. But, um, I just realized I'm watching every single, almost every single HBO show in 2024. And some in 2025. No joke. I, I realized this not too long ago, but I mean, like, watch. I'm, I'm very excited for these shows, but I mean... It's crazy to think about. What do I want? We've got a missing I'm watching this. Frozen into a giant block of flesh. Definitely. Information from a murder investigation. Why keep it a secret? I'm watching this. Love this kingfisher blue. I'll try not to get blood on it. A limited series, too. I'm watching this. I don't like it as much. I don't really like Game of Thrones too much, but I'm ready this far. They want you to spy on me. Yeah, I gotta spy this is the like one of the only ones that I may not watch, but I might be into it. Maybe I don't know. This is what I'm watching too. I'm already on season two. Also, I'm not sure, and I'm not sure about that. I'm watching. I'm watching this. I'm watching this. It's one of my favorite shows. Not that. I'm gonna be watching this show. And I'm gonna be watching Pretty Little Lies. Look. I gotta just talk about Pretty Little Lies. This show. I've been so excited for this show. And then the writer's strike came out. I'm like, I've been waiting for season two. But now it's called Summer School now. But I mean, it's for the original, original Sins. Um, series, but I mean, the writer's strike, and this show was supposed to come out November, December of 2023. And it's coming out sometime in probably January, February, March, right around there. It's coming soon, they just finished filming in December. So, yeah, I'm gonna continue. And also, um, they confirmed that, that this is from episode one, and this is the, uh, new killer, and... There's a stunt that they confirmed that's happening. So, I've been waiting for a second to and I've been waiting for this show too, Hacks. Um, last year, last year, beginning of last year, this year, it's been all over. But um, I watched season two, three. But then they confirmed another season. But then the strikes came out, so there was no news of filming. It. I, I think it would have been by now, like, they would have sent out a trailer, but I mean... And I'm watching this, because I'm already watching the, the Batman movie, and it's in the same universe, and in 2025, The Last of Us. I'm gonna watch The Last of Us. Euphoria. And this is that. And, and I may watch this, but I never watched it. But, I mean... I was watching this. At first... At first I was like, uh-huh. Yeah, I'll see that. I'll see that. And, and then after a little bit, I realized... I went through the whole thing. I'm watching almost everything that they're releasing. All the shows from Max and HBO. I'm, I'm seeing pretty much all of them. The Last of Us, 100%. I'm seeing that 100%. My favorite shows, though, like, I'm not gonna have, like, every single show that, that's my favorite. I'm um, like, A True Detective, no. No. Not my favorite. Also, like I said, not my favorite. But, I mean, this is closer to a favorite show, but it's not, like, top up there, like, oh, hey, favorite show. It's, like, a secondary favorite show. Like, if I do not have my favorite shows, I'd choose this, too. But it's not, like, up there as, like, a favorite favorite. But, I mean, I got... This show is one of my favorite shows. I think I've watched season one and two over... I don't know. A hundred times, at least. Fifty times. I'm over, over exaggerating on the amount of times. Pretty Little Lives, I watched over probably the first season. Probably... 
this one would be probably 90 times 100. Because I watched season 1, and I watched the first two episodes that released over and over again, pretty much. I, I, I had nothing else to watch, so like, whenever I hung out and I watched things, I watched this. I think this show is better better than the original. Um, I like the original, but the final season was a lot more, um, slow. Um, the first few seasons was great, but I mean, they slowed down the whole series. But still one of my favorite shows. Another one of my favorite shows is Hacks. The Penguin, it hasn't even started yet, but I'm not really into that universe too much. I'm into, like, all those other universes. And The Last of Us. I've been I've been playing The Last of Us since I was like 13, 14 years old. And now there's like the most happening. It pretty much killed my likeness for Walking Dead. This show is and game is so much like there's so much Last of Us happening right now since 2020 that like I even want to watch Walking Dead anymore. There's The Last of Us Part 2 that came out in 2020. My aunt got it for me. There's now The Last of Us part, part 1 Remake came out. I got that. I bought it. I even have three different versions of The Last of Us Part 1. Do I have it right here? One. Literally. I don't have it on me. I think it's, I think it's the one behind me. But I have the very last one that came, <coughs> came out last September. And I have the very, very, very first one. I started playing on the PS3 when I lived in Long Island. I lived in Long Island. I'm sorry, I lived in Long Island when I first started playing this game. I started playing the multiplayer then too. But then no one... My, my dad did not have the game, so I didn't play with him. But I mean, this game is why Fortnite is a thing. This game is why, like... Like, Apex is a thing. This is the reason. The multiplayer that's on it is the very first game that you have to craft your things and build up. Just like Fortnite. Just like Apex, that you grab your weapons and all, and all that, and you grab your things. This game start, started it all. And then it came, um, Fortnite, Apex, all that. But this, like, a lot of people are talking about online now, like, why... Why, like, hasn't this game been been talked about that much if it came out in 2013 versus Fortnite came out and all this other stuff came out way earlier. I mean, way later. But, I mean, I'm just surprised that the amount of stuff that I'm watching on HBO, it's... Like, I mean, I'm just thinking about it. Like, it's... It's surprising. Really? What happened to Walking Dead that I don't watch Walking Dead anymore? Because ever since Carl died, like, I I went into a mess. Like, why would they kill off a character that should have lived till the end? Just for money? Just, like, just, really, just for money. He literally turned 18, 17, or whatever. And he just got an apartment, thinking, thinking that he was going to film the next three seasons in, in Georgia. And he got killed off that year. Like, what? Like, that... That was one I had, like, an iffy feeling about about Walking Dead. Because Carl should not have died. He should have lived. There was no reason to kill him off just because you wanted to kill him off and you wanted money. Max. Max would not have done that. And now Max is trying to buy Walking Dead. And they want to reboot their own series. If that happens... Then yes, I'll like Walking Dead again. But till then, it's a mess on AMC. Like I still like some things. I like I like the original Walking Dead, like the beginning, season three, season four. I love the Telltale game so much. This is like the final thing that I like. There's no more. But yet, originally, The Walking Dead was going to Max, well HBO, and they took it down. They turned it down, and they thought it was too violent. Zombies are too violent, but yet, but yet they did Game of Thrones. They did Game of Thrones, the one that has the most craziest nudity scenes, violence, so on, and it got the most popular show ever. One of the most popular shows. 
well, the original. This is the uh, um spinoff, as I should say. But um, come on, it's crazy to think about. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll see you next one, and bye.